Since everyone hates streamers that spam ads, I have finally found the best Twitch ad blocker out there. Let's get into it. Okay, so this is part three on my channel because every few months, Twitch decides to go after uBlock Origin or any ad blockers and just takes them down so you can't block ads on Twitch. But I've always seemed to find a way past it because I personally hate watching ads and I know millions out there hate it too. So step one on this, you're gonna wanna get uBlock Origin. You just search it on Google Chrome uBlock Origin. It's an extension to Google Chrome. Once you get that, you're going to download it to your Chrome. Once it's at the top of Chrome, you're going to click it. It's going to look like this. It's a little extension. You're going to click the three little gears in the bottom right corner. You're going to open the dashboard. It's going to look something like this. It's going to have a bunch of stuff. I know it looks confusing. Do not worry about it. You're going to scroll to the bottom of the settings tab and it says, I'm an advanced user. You're going to click it and it should pop up something like this. Yes, it's confusing. Do not worry. It looks like code. I don't have a degree in coding. Neither do you. Maybe you do. <laughs> But if you do, you probably can code this because this is where I got it from. There's this link right here under user resources. The link I post in the description, you're going to copy it. You're going to paste it into this area here and remove whatever's there. Pause it on this part right here and follow through on how to do it. It's very simple. It took me less than three minutes to do. And what happens on Twitch now, when a streamer plays an ad, the screen kind of goes in like 720p. Pretty much, you just, you still see them and you can watch through it. This is the best one yet. I've had no problems with it, except for it going to 720p, which I know some of you may not like. I don't like it, but it's better than sitting there and watching an ad on the most useless product out there that will never make it. I'm sure there'll be many more to this because again twitch always seems to knock these down and i know i know that's their main source for them that's how they make their money is ads hopefully twitch doesn't see this video and i don't get banned for people uh, that are interested this is what it actually looks like when it's blocking ads so in the top corner it actually says blocking ads and it goes into a lower quality video for me that's fine because then i still get to watch the stream without an ad being thrown in my face now there's only one alternate way besides getting a free twitch ad block and it's twitch turbo it's twitch Twitch Turbo, ad free viewing, you get a chat badge beside your name, you get an extended emoticon set, custom chat username colors, extended broadcast storage. So a lot of you guys don't know, but a lot of us do get this. A lot of us have cool badges. We may not have this one, but we do have cool badges. Um, a lot of us get, you could, anyone could change your color on Twitch. They just have more. This is just for streamers. And a lot of people don't stream. So Twitch Turbo in the US costs $11.99 per month. So if you're willing to pay $11.99 per month, and this is your only form of content that you consume, you don't consume like Netflix or any other subscription services, then that's great. You'll be able to watch Twitch ad free, or you can do what I told you from the start of the video and it's get you block origin all free except when an ad is playing it goes into 720p so whatever floats your boat whatever you're okay with I personally will do it for the cheaper amount because I'm cheap thank you guys for watching I'll put the exact links below on how to do this I'll put the screenshot on the screen so you can see it and more of these videos will come up if you guys want to see more streamer advice or uh, how to start streaming and how to start YouTube videos comment below and I can start making different videos on that don't forget to like subscribe and uh, if you have any questions leave them in the comments below